Now we're going to take a look, making use of a glamour image, of the skin softening techniques uh, and the choices that you have within the Craig's Actions Beauty Bar, as well as we'll look at the blemish busting uh, action and how quickly that can work for you. So let's zoom in and have a look at our image here. We've done the eyes uh, in a previous step and we're going to deal with, she doesn't really have a complexion problem, but there's enough there that we're going to make use of our action available to us uh, within the blemish busters. So let's scroll down to the touch-up section of the Craig's Actions uh, bl blemish buster within the beauty bar. And we've got four settings within here, uh, three different intensities and one custom that'll walk you through each step of the way. So let's use our medium. We'll press play. Your instructions pop up. You can always put these away and so that they don't pop up in front of you the next time around. Your settings here, your radius determines the strength of the effect going in, and the threshold is the detail. If you were to have no detail, then you'd have clumps of areas uh, that were previously uh, problematic blemishes. So you want to strike the balance between the strength of the effect and the detail that's coming through. And so we're going to, let's just take that up a little bit, and we're going to have a slightly stronger effect which is pretty good. You'll get a feel for that pretty quick. Press play, wanders through, uh, brings up the next stage, and now it's cueing us to brush over the dark areas. So I can make use of a, get our brush setting up here. You'll see nine becomes 90, five becomes 50. We're going to select a fairly heavy brush and just go over the blemish areas that we would consider dark and often with some of the blemishes they've got a dark side and a light side which we'll deal with shortly so we're just going to look overall and we can work with larger brushes uh, if we want just to make things a little quicker uh, it's a pretty effective tool so we'll just come in on there we've got things the way that we want that looks pretty good now we'll carry on press play and it'll cue us for the next stage which of course is the lighter one so we'll press stop now we'll come in on there we've got that set and she's pretty good uh, this just takes a couple of seconds and that's pretty much it there uh, we'll carry on to finish off and you'll see that there's a before and an after we'll zoom in before and after. Just a few seconds is all it takes. All our facial features and details are there, nicely intact. So let's go into our skin softening options. We can make in make use of the skin softening in either a lighten or a slightly darker version. Uh, soft and light will lighten up the skin tone or where the softening is applied. The soft and rich will give it a slightly darker feel to it. So let's work with our soft and light versions. And again, you've got a graduation from the lighter treatment to the glamour to the pinup, which is a stronger effect, or custom, where you can control it each step of the way. So let's go with our middle level one on the glamour skin softening. We'll press play. Walks through. And again, you can turn this off and just make use of the defaults. Uh, you can see we've got this beautiful richness that's happening with our softening as it applies to the image. And guess what? It's finished. That's as long as it took. We've still got the detail in the eyes. We've still got the detail in the lips. If we zoom in, look at what happened to our hair around here. We've got this beautiful softening going on. Brought up this nice intensity. Zoom out. You can see throughout the skin tones. All the way, we've got this beautiful tonality that exists bring that down and we've still got control to take that as little or as much as we want uh, and if we wanted to brush it out if we thought that uh, it had gone a little too much and we could say well you know we can bring back just a little bit in the shadow areas of the eyes uh, we're done 